Hello there, my Scorpio collective. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Oh, Scorpios, what is up with your energy? What is up with your energy? Oh, Scorpios. Fuck, don't be so quick with the gifting. Don't be so quick. Step back for a minute. What is up? What is up? What is up? What is up, Scorpios? Ooh. So you're feeling good. Things are good. You're in a good energy. You could be celebrating something. Seven of Pentacles at the bottom. An offer in waiting. Five of Swords here with the Hermit. Oh, you've caught someone's attention here, Scorpio. There could be an offer in the waiting. Hmm. Uh, you dealing with a Virgo in particular? A Virgo or an Aquarian energy? Uh, this could be a star search energy for some of you, Scorpios. Um, keep doing whatever the fuck it is you're doing. Ace of Cups. Knight of Cups. Temperance Angel. Sit your ass down and chill. I think you're in like such a beautiful energy. The full card. Oh my goodness. Scorpio, someone's watching and paying attention to you. It could be like an Earth Angel energy. A good opportunity. Whatever the fuck it is you're doing, Scorpios, keep focusing on it. I don't think you know this energy. I, I don't think you know this. I think you're over here focusing on yourself. And someone's noticed the difference. Someone's noticed the change. Mm. It, it's almost like an opportunity. I feel like it's a, a good opportunity. But you need to be in a good energy space. Capricorn energy here. Hmm. covers that Capricorn. Knight of Pentacles. Be mindful of your contracts, Scorpios. If you're given an opportunity, be mindful of the contracts. Six of Cups. Holy hell here, Scorpio. What's over that Six of Cups? Hierophant Energy. Damn, Scorpios, you guys got a blessing coming in. But make sure you read the, the fine prints. Make sure you understand everything. Knight of Pentacles, Page of Wands. Some of you could be turning down one offer and taking another one. Um, it's not necessarily playing hardball, Scorpio, but don't just take any uh, offer that shows up. Someone could be wearing a mask. You got a lot of potential here, and that's the thing. You could have multiple offers, multiple opportunities wanting to come your way, but don't just take the first one that shows the fuck up. Trust your intuition here. This Ace of Cups, Six of Cups, Temperance Angel, Queen of Pentacles, Knight of Cups. You need to make sure you stay grounded and focused with something. Um, allow yourself to sort of enjoy the offer, but then you really need to take time and really look into it. This is about contractual energy. Uh, know who the hell you're dealing with. Some of you are going to walk away from an opportunity because it is, there's just too much. There's just too much to it. It isn't worth your time, energy, or effort. So you need to be reading the uh, fine print, really paying attention to offers coming your way. If this is work-related, definitely pay attention. Uh, know who the hell you're dealing with. 
know what's up, you need to read the fine print and see. Because some of you, uh, that Knight of Pentacles there, you could be getting screwed over financially on something. So if you don't know what the fuck it deals with, find someone that does. If this is an emotional relationship or partnership, don't go so fast. Don't go so fast. Especially if you're just coming from this sort of healed, healed space energy. You got people wearing masks. So that for that to show up with you is you're, you got an opportunity. Some of you, multiple opportunities here. But which is the better offer? Pay attention to the fine print. Really look into it. Hold off. Hold off. Some of you are definitely going to be turning down because you, you don't really quite know or trust whoever the fuck this is you're dealing with. Uh, you're in a good energy space. Uh, I don't see comeback around energy. Some of y'all don't need that shit in your life. You got the Hierophant. Uh, Capricorn and Temperance Angel here. So whatever you're dealing with, you're going to be able to navigate it just fine. Um, you need to be more in your head than your heart. Yeah. There's an opportunity you don't need. There could be multiple opportunities you don't need. Relationships, partnerships. You got a lot of mask wearers around you. So you just really have to be mindful of that Capricorn energy. What's really going to be good for you and what's not? Um, you know, you could get a job opportunity. Uh, musicians, right? There's a lot of people that have get recording contracts. But at the end of the day, the contract is really shit. <laughs> right? If, you're, if someone's looking at coming towards you, you need to pay attention. Some of you are going to walk the fuck away because you don't like the terms of the agreement. There ain't fucking nothing wrong with that either. So we got seven of pens. Yeah, you just need to be mindful of offers and opportunities that come towards you and check that shit out. If you do not know what the fuck is up, you need to. You need to. This is a good opportunity. But you need to know what the fuck is up. You need to know what's up. So... Any contracts, get someone to look at it to explain it to you. Uh, Work-related, if this is a job promotion, a new job opportunity, don't be seduced by the pentacle energy. Because some of you, it, it's you need to be boss-ass energy here. Not every opportunity is going to be to your benefit. Does some of you watch Shark Tank? Shark Tank comes up, right? Uh, this could be a good business opportunity or something, uh, creative arts, but pay attention. There's something here that you need to be paying attention to. Some of you are seriously going to have to get someone else to look into something, especially if you have no idea what the fuck this is. So be mindful of your contracts. Be mindful of your contracts. That's good, Scorpio. Uh, if it's not physical contracts, this is the emotional contracts, right? Ten of Swords. Damn, Scorpio, someone really wants to come towards you, but just be mindful. Be mindful. Oh, my God. Some of you are the emotional relationships and partnerships. Damn, do not tap into that. Scorpios, until you understand the complexity and the fullness of something, don't you don't need to get involved in anything. That heart chakra is opening, so you are looking good to people, but you don't need that shit. This is like no retrograde. Yeah, look, it's a karmic energy. So you've been down this road before. You've been down this road before. Set this shit out. Set this shit out because you do not need it. Something just wants to stir up some conflict. Because you're on that... You're on that good side of that Wheel of Fortune energy. You need to stay in that. 
Yeah. Oh, God dang. It is retrograde. Definitely. Be mindful of relationships and partnerships. Read your contracts. Find out what the fuck is up. Some of you emotionally, don't go down that road again. You've been there. Whatever this energy is, you've been here, done this before. So you already know. Hopefully you know you well enough to avoid this shit. Yep. Mm. Oh, Scorpios. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Definitely be mindful of your contracts here. Some of you... You don't need to take every offer that comes towards you, right? When things start getting good, trust your gut, your guidance, and your intuition. Don't rush. Some of you don't fucking rush. Don't rush into anything. Take your time. Take your time. Know your contracts. Know what the fuck is up. If you don't understand it, find somebody who does. That's beautiful, Scorpio. Peace, love, and light. And it's okay to turn down offers. You don't have to take anything that's given to you. Peace, love, and light, Scorpio.